Hi, my name is Dennis Murphy. I am the athletic director and boys basketball coach at South Medford High School. Uh, I have been an employee of the Medford School District for 27 years, uh, and they've been 27 great years. Uh, I'm so disappointed in where we are today uh, because, you know, this is not in anyone's best interest, and I, I, I feel terrible that we got to this point. And uh, my biggest concern is not that we're at the point now, but we got to get off the point and get this fixed. And uh, there's a lot of talk about what did or didn't happen. And, and um, you know, what I could tell you from this morning after having been on the picket line, this is day four and this is the first day that we have students. Uh, there's no education being taking place right now. I mean, uh, the students are telling us that there are anywhere from 40 to 60 kids in class. Uh, you know, they're given packets of anything. In some cases, teachers, substitute teachers haven't shown up. I mean, there's not a teacher on the line that would expect someone to walk in and try to educate 60 kids at a time. I mean, that's not fair to substitutes. So, uh, I surely understand that a plan was devised to think that this could work, and, and the truth is it can't. And uh, we need to really see the, the big picture here. The real big picture is we've all been hired to educate students of, South, of Medford, uh, school district and right now that's not taking place at any level and for us to color it any other way is entirely wrong um, you know I have a concern that our school board and our negotiating team or the two negotiating teams one for the district and one for uh, the MEA where we thought it would be a collaborative experience and get this problem solved I really believe personally it's become a competitive experience and, and this isn't about one team winning and the other team losing who's losing are our students and, and that's not fair, that's not good for anyone. And so we need to all figure out how to get on the winning side and, and get this problem resolved. And again, if we'll get back to the table and collaborate, and do we both have to give? I think we do. Do I think from our standpoint, are we willing to give? We are, you know, and again, I don't know all the facts, and I'm surely not gonna sit here and point fingers because I can't fix what's happened. What I wanna fix is what's gonna happen. And, and what I know is each day that we're out here, that less and less is being done for our kids. And that's not the world we as teachers live in. We're about doing what's best for kids, and we're going to do it 24-7. And that's not taking place. And the reason it's not taking place is because people took that away from us. And so, you know, we need to get this fixed. We need to get back to where teachers belong, and that's in classrooms, doing what they do best, which is teach our kids, which in turn make all of us very proud that we have the students that come from the Medford School District and, and do as well as they do and excel at the levels they do uh, in the classroom, on the in the theater, on the athletic fields, it doesn't make any difference. But uh, we need to come to a resolution, we need to get this done, and we need to get it done now. If 